G'day, how are you? Uh, Dean here, and today I want to show you a quick release system for your tripod head. So normally these are a bit of a nuisance to take off, but this system allows very quick changing of heads. Now you may wonder why, why would I want to do that? Well, there's actually lots of reasons why this is an advantage. Um, you may have different heads that you use, that you might have one set of tripod legs, you may have a video head, so you're continually swapping, especially a gimbal, if you use a gimbal, um, it may not be set up on its own tripod, so it, you, know, you may, as I said, have the one set of legs, multiple different heads. So to change the head normally, you have to undo the grub screws, um, take it off, put the other head on, lock in the grub screws, and then away you go. With this system, you know, it's on and off in seconds. So that's one advantage. Um, if you travel like me, I like to take a medium sized suitcase and this um, setup doesn't fit in that suitcase. I need to take the head off. So normally to do that, I would have to split the whole system and then put it in as two pieces. But with this, I can now just take that off, put it um, safely in its little bag and then the legs will fit into my suitcase. You may also like to use your bag that the tripod came in. Now, how many times you get a bag and it fits beautifully with the tripod, as soon as you put a head on it, it doesn't fit. So you can't really use the bag. Very, very annoying. So this allows for that. Um, another reason why you may want to use this is you may like to strap your tripod to your camera bag, okay, when you're, when you're hiking or walking. And you know, with a heavy head, um, at the top sometimes that unbalances your tripod, uh, unbalances your bag and it's a little bit sort of awkward. If it's sitting up high it can catch in trees or whatever. So this again is a great system where you, you just take it off, put it into your camera bag where it's um, safe and then these will fit onto your backpack without any overhead weight. So that's the, you know, the main reasons why you would want to use this system. Um, now let me just strip this down and I'm going to show you the two bits that it comes with, uh, the two parts to it and how you assemble it. Okay, I have re I've removed the, um, the quick release system. And so the first thing you need to do is you need to remove your, your head off of your tripod. Now I said there'll be two little grub screws under here. Um, so if you, have, if you have tightened those, you'll need to loosen those off. And then the head just unscrews off the tripod. Okay, so that comes off. Now, for this quick release system, there's, there's essentially two parts to it. So this is the first one. This is the plate that sits on top of your tripod. Now, I've had a look around and um, I really love Sunway Photo products. I've been using them for many years now. They're great quality. And I found this one just suited it perfectly because it's, a, because it's, it's round in design. It's 58 mil diameter, so it'll suit most tripods. So that's the, um, the plate that goes onto your tripod. And then the other piece you need is just, it's just basically a quick release plate that you would normally put onto your camera. Now, the reason why I've gone for this one is um, it comes with two, two screws. So most, um, sorry, most heads will be a 3 8 screw in here. But just in case you've got a quarter, um, if you had a quarter you would have to bush it out but you don't with this kit because it gives you two screws. I'll just show you what I mean. So this is the plate here and I've got the 3 8 um, screw in it because that's what I'm going to use. But in the kit you also get the smaller one. So that's the quarter one. So if you had, um, if your tripod 
head had the small thread in it, then with this quick release plate, you would take um, that one out and you would put the little one in. Okay, um, now I sell these kits, uh, I've set it up as a kit, so if you're in Australia, you can buy the kit off me. If you're not in Australia, then basically all you need to do, you can source Sunway Photo Parts, those two bits there. Um, or otherwise, you know, all you really need is a quick release plate and some sort of a plate that will go um, onto your tripod. So this is basically designed to replace the top plate of, of any um, tripod head. Okay, let's put this guy together. So um, we take our, our, our top plate. Now also, I'll just point out, this is hollowed out underneath, so they've done that to, to drop weight. This only weighs 65 grams, okay? And then this quick release plate is 35 grams. So the whole thing is 100 grams, which is nothing, okay? So don't tell me that you're traveling and you haven't got enough weight to put this system on because you have. Right, so all we do is we just screw that on, okay? And we just put it down tight, and then what I would do is underneath here, there's two little grub screws. So just nip them up, okay? Um, now it should come with a, now the Allen keys that come with a kit may not be the right size for your little grub screws. Um, if it's not, you're gonna have to just find the one that fits. But just nip them up and then this is basically set to go. If you don't have grub screws on here, then what I would advise is that you put a little bit of Loctite on this, okay, because you don't want this coming loose. Righto, so um, that is basically your tripod done. So then we take our ball head, uh, which I'm gonna use this one here, and we just screw this into the base of our ball head. Okay, and then we need an Allen key which one is it? So just line that up. Do this up nice and tight. And I don't think you need Loctite on this one, okay? Because it's got a rubber base on it, which helps it grip. And as long as you do that up fairly tight, um, then you're set to go. Now I'll just show you another little tip. Just grab the Allen key out. When you get this quick release plate, okay, these two little stop screws here will be loose. So just make sure that you nip those up. And I'll show you what they're for in a secchi. Okay, so that's it, you're done. So we've got the plate on here, um, the, new, the new top plate, and then we've got our quick release on here. So that basically just sits in and then we lock it up. Okay, done. And that's really solid. I have no issues with like another piece being in there that I get, you know, any sort of a movement. That is rock solid. Um, now I'll just show you what those little set screws are for. So, and you do need to have those in, or I advise that you have those in. So just say, just say this came loose for some reason, then this will start moving, but those set screws stop it from falling out. Okay, so the whole, the whole head's not gonna fall off. Now, in looking at this, this design, I looked at different top plates. Some, you can get a lever type or, a, or um, the knob type here. There's also one of these with a, with a long knob on it, a, a longer shaft on here. But I sort of thought, you know, if it's out too far here, it can get caught on things and get annoying. Um, and lever type, um, I just don't like the lever type. I, I find it much easier to, to use these. Um, and I did find one system that had a, had a great big lever. So again, you know, it sort of tends to get caught on things. So look, that is basically it. Um, as I say, it's, yeah, it's a great system, really quick and easy way of being able to remove your um, heads from your tripod. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, give us a thumbs up if you did and just hit us up with questions below. Thanks for watching, see ya.